A programming language is just that, a programming language. You can use a programming language to do almost anything. And D1 of event-driven programming asks you to examine how you might use an event-driven programming language to complete other tasks. So, for example, whether you could use uh, Visual Basic to shovel data from one database to another, or to create a text file that contains a list of all the files in a particular directory. These are non-graphical applications. Applications that you run, create a result, but the user doesn't actually see anything on the screen. So it's up to you to examine what sort of things these languages could do.